Hi guys, thanks for joining me. Today we're going to be talking about the C note and how to find it and remember it. We're going to be talking about the treble clef and the lines and spaces which make up the musical staff. So, with no further ado, this is da -da -da, notation, and we've got every E, G, B, D, F, every good boy does fine. That's how we remember those lines. And then we've got F, A, C, E, or friends always choose each other. I just made that up not that long ago. So there you have it. And we're gonna be learning about the C note today and how to recognize it and find it. We're not gonna be learning this C today. We're gonna be learning this C, the one that's below the staff. And you'll find that a lot when you're doing songs like um, Baba Black Sheep or um, Hot Cross Buns. You're gonna see that a lot on the musical staff and you're gonna be like, where is that? What is that note? So. If you just do the musical alphabet and you work backwards, that's how you're gonna find out what that is. So you know that there's F and then there's E, right? E, of musical alphabets, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and then it starts over A, B, C, D, E, F, G. So basically, we're just doing our, alf our musical alphabet and we know that C, and then we've got D, and then we have E, and F, and G. So how do we recognize where the C, this C note is? This is what it looks like a lot on your musical, um, on your composition paper. And it's the C note, here's your treble clef. So you know what, I drew right here to help me remember. Sometimes I like to think about it as two different ways, whatever's gonna help you. We've got it could be a kitty, if you can kind of see the whiskers and the ears. If you watch my other video, you see I like to draw little pictures to help me remember in the little tail. Um, and it's a cat, obviously. It's a cat. Kind of looks like a frog too, but it's not. It's a cat. And it's sleeping way below the base. Like, all, if all these are floors of a house, it's sleeping in the nice cold basement. Or you could think about it as... A submarine below sea level because get it it's sea level so it's the C note um, so you could do little I'm just kind of doing this backwards but you could do um, little little bubbles like a submarine or you could make it super artistic and I'm just not so you could think about it two couple ways so when you always see the note with the line through it it's a C okay so I hope that helps you remember how to find the C note and you won't have to do your musical alphabet to find it. Okay, it's a very short lesson, but I hope it's worthwhile and I hope you keep on rocking on. Thank you.